Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, what is the difference between assert and verify commands in Selenium ID? Let me answer. So here, I would like to explain the difference between assert and verify commands in Selenium ID. This side, I'll write assert. And this side, I'll write verify command. Okay, this is verify. So what is the difference? When you use assert command in Selenium ID, let's say this Selenium ID, and uh, this has some steps, okay? Some automation steps are there in this. Let's say like this. For example, at this place, okay? For example, here, this particular line, assume that this particular line has an assert statement. Assert command is there in this particular line. And assume that this particular line is failing, okay? This is failing actually, okay? This particular line is failing. In that case, the execution will stop there itself, okay? The test execution will stop there itself and remaining lines, these lines won't be executed, okay? Because here the assert statement got failed because of which the execution of this code got stopped here at the same line where the assert statement uh, got failed and remaining lines won't be executed. But what about the verify command in Selenium ID? So unlike assert, the execution will continue. Even though that particular line containing the verify command fails, still the execution is going to continue. Okay, Let me show you here also. For example, at this line, uh, the verify command is there. Assume that in this particular line, verify command is there and this statement got failed. Okay, This statement got failed. In that case, the execution will not stop here. The execution will continue. The execution will continue irrespective of whether this particular statement containing the verify got passed or failed, it will continue and remaining lines will be executed. Okay, Remaining lines will be executed. But in this case, the execution will stop where the asset command statement fails and remaining lines won't be executed. Hope you got the idea on what is the difference between asset and verify commands. Let me practically demonstrate this for you in Selenium ID. For that, I'll open the browser. I'll take you to this application URL. And here I'll click on Selenium ID and I'll record a test now. Uh, then I'll say create a new project. I'll say demo project. Okay. Click on record. Here I have to give the URL. Copy this URL and give it here. Say start recording. Now maximize this. Now here type, click here and type HP. Click on search button. And then here, right click on this, uh, op uh, this uh, product and uh, say Selenium ID. And here there are two things. One is assert, one is assert, and other one is verify, right? I'll go with assert first, assert present. Then after that, after asserting present, I'll continue, I'll click on this link. Like this, I'll click on the link. Let the link open. Now here, uh, I would like to click on the home page. Okay, after clicking on the link. These are the steps I recorded, stop it and give the test name as a test one or something. Say, okay, maximize. Now just see here, these are the steps which got recorded. Okay, first uh, open the browser, maximize the browser window, click type HP into the search box, we'll click on the search button. Then here asset is there. After that, you know, you're doing a lot of stuff. Okay, but these statements won't be executed. If this particular thing fails, if this uh, particular thing fails, then these statements won't be executed. For example, intentionally, I'll change to HPA or uh, uh, I'll say Honda otherwise. Okay. When I search for Honda, will I get this product in the this product in the search results? No, right? Still, you are verifying. So this will fail. And since it fails, the assertion statement failed, right? Here itself. The execution will stop here and the remaining code, remaining lines will not be executed. Okay. We'll see that. Run this. Intentionally, I'm failing the assert statement here. Honda, click on the search button. It fails, you see, this failed means remaining steps have not been executed, right? Like that. What about if I change this to, instead of uh, assert element present, if I say verify, verify element present, if I see, and now if I click on this run, see what's happening. It will not be able to click it, okay? But it will continue the execution though, okay? It, it is trying to click, but uh, it's not able to find the element. That's okay. You see, it's still trying. The remaining steps are being executed here. Okay. Even though this fails, it's trying to click on that uh, 
uh, you know some product which is not there so uh, some time out will be there till that it will keep waiting and after that it will fail this one also okay just wait for this to complete you can clearly see that when this fails the execution is being continued okay when this fails the execution is continuing okay the remaining steps are being executed okay with help with verify command okay verify command will continue the execution whereas assert command will stop the execution there itself okay or we can do one more thing here let's uh, delete all this stuff and uh, here uh, here let's say open open some url will give just to see whether the remaining code is getting executed or not what is the remaining code this is the remaining code okay. like this i'll say now run this when the verify statement containing verify command fails it will continue the execution you see the, uh, the step which is after the failed verify command is still running okay it got run that is the difference between asset and verify in case of asset this is not going to happen if you put uh, instead of uh, verify if you put asset here and run it when it fails the execution will stop there itself and the remaining step is uh, the remaining steps after the failed uh, assertion step are not executed okay that's what is the difference between verify and, and uh, assert commands in selenium id so that's all for this session thank you bye